Hi, welcome back. Uh, so in yesterday's vlog, we looked at how you could actually create multiple plans within the same Office 365 uh, group or Microsoft Teams sites. So in this vlog, I wanted to st still stay on the topic of uh, you know dealing with multiple plans. And uh, with the recent update, you're now able to actually move tasks from one plan to the other, right? Previous to this, uh, it, it, it used to be a manual exercise where you have to create all the tasks, uh, you know, uh, from scratch. So uh, with this new update, you're, if, if you have an existing plan uh, with a bunch of tasks that you normally use for, let's say, your projects or events or whatever, uh, if you already have a bunch of tasks with the boards and uh, everything planned, you can now actually move those tasks from one plan to the other. So uh, without wasting any time, let's jump in and have a look on how you could do that. All right, uh, here we are on the uh, Microsoft Planner Hub uh, and here I have campaign one. Now, this is one of the campaigns, uh, with one of the plans that I've created yesterday. And here you can actually see the tasks that I've uh, created in yesterday's video. So if I actually go ahead and select the tasks, I click on the three dots and click copy task. And, and here you can actually see um, you have, you know, you can actually change the name of the tasks as you copy that, copy it. Or you could also change the, uh, you can actually set what to include as part of um, copying the tasks to a different plan. So uh, let's, let's give it that. I, I only want to uh, bring in description, checklist, attachments and labels. Uh, for now, I'm just going to just move the date, select the dates. And then the, the, the main part of this is you know, you, the ability to select a plan. As you can see here, you can actually go and access the, the recent plans that I've created and worked on. Um, here you can see campaign one, campaign two, and campaign three uh, that I've created in my last video. So, uh, but the thing though is one thing to note is it, it's not just uh, the ability for you to move plan, uh, tasks within uh, the plans that are created within that group uh, itself, but you could actually move them outside to a different group. So it doesn't matter. You can move, let's say you have a plan in HR, you have a plan in marketing. You want to move a task from HR plan to a marketing plan with a different membership. You know, you could do that. So in this case, I'm going to actually move uh, the plan to campaign two. Right, and and the best part is when you move the campaign uh, to uh, to a different sorry plan, it automatically picks up the buckets and it'll tell you which bucket do I do do you want me to put it in. Here you can only see uh, one uh, bucket, but if I actually go and select a different uh, campaign, you could see oh, there's only one bucket in that as well. Let's third time lucky. Let's see if I can actually pick up. Uh, there you go. There's, there's multiple. I've picked up uh, marketing campaigns and you can actually see multiple buckets in there. And if I just go ahead and say, OK, move to the tab tablet campaign and click. Uh, just just one thing I've noticed, though, is when you move between uh, different uh, plans from one plan to the other, when they, when they are actually in a different Office 65 groups, the uh, the assignment and the attachments and labels are actually grayed out. So in this case, I just wanted to move to the sales plan itself. So just, just keep that in mind, move to to do, and click copy. Task is copied. And if you click on that, it automatically takes you to campaign two and it opens up the task for you. So there you have it. That's a quick uh, learning video on how to move tasks from one plan to the other. My name is Jag Kakarlapudi. I create daily Office 65 learning videos and you can check out more videos on my uh, blog modernwork.cloud. Thanks a lot and stay tuned for more videos in the coming days. If you haven't connected with me on LinkedIn yet, uh, please do connect or follow me on LinkedIn and I actually release uh, these videos on LinkedIn first before on, on any other platform. Thanks a lot and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.